guys, it's Chilly, and today we're doing Our Crate and how to unbox them. Our Crate is a fantastic subscription box that I have basically been watching unboxings of since the dawn of time. So it is a YA based box featuring one hardcover book every month, filled with a bunch of goodies too. And I feel so honored that Our Crate sent me out this box to review for you guys. So let's get into it. So first of all, I'm going to show you guys how to unbox this great box, which you can only do in a very particular way. So first of all, you got to grab your giant ass knife, then you get your box here, and you got to look for the tape. Now the tape could literally be anywhere, so you kind of just have to like really try and find the tape, you know. It can be a little hard to do when you're looking at the camera, but I'm sure you'll be able to find it. Oop, there we go. Now that you got your tape, you got to make sure that you loosen up everything inside a little bit, so you got to throw it around. That'll get it. Sometimes it's even best to just kind of stamp on it a little bit. You know, it's really tough to really open that lid. You gotta loosen it up. But there's one way that I find is the best way to really help unboxing these. And that's fire! Ah, and now we have the box open. Let's get into it, shall we? So the Alquate Theatre. Magical monthly read, so fantastic, so mysterious, running all through January. So this is the information card. I will gather information off this to tell you guys about all the products that are inside this box and tell you guys what the book is about. So the theme of this January box is classic remix and let's get started. So we got a lot of noodles. I probably should have burned the noodles. That would have made a lot more sense. Ooh. First up, we have The Little Prince, which is a first edition tea company, mint and rose herbal tea. And I don't know if you guys know this, but I love tea, so I'm very very excited about this and I bet it smells amazing. <gasps> this is so freaking cute. Oh my god. <gasps> bath products? Oh my god, please tell me that is for my bath. It's a soap. I'm so excited. I love my bath and it's a book inspired bath. This is from the library of tea soap books and owl crate. The soap is the secret garden. The scent is white tea and berries and that is so super cool. I cannot wait to use this. Oh my god. Oh my god, I could cry if I really wanted to. There's a little magnet on it, it says The Phantom of the Opera, and this has been hand designed by Seed Sequels, and it's really cute. You can never really have too many magnets, especially if you have a life like me that is just like little notes of scrap paper everywhere that you need to remember by sticking on the fridge. Sweet! I've been in dire need of a new calendar, and now I have one. And I need both hands to actually flip through this because I'm so excited. Oh my god, it's all classics. Alice in Wonderland, The Wizard of Oz, The Call of the Wind. Oh my god. What is my month? What's, what's December? Jules Verne, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Everything was beautiful and nothing hurt. And I officially, like all other bookmarks that I get, am never using this because there is no way I would ever risk destroying this beautiful bookmark. So this bookmark was created by... Lexi Olivia just for this box is a quote from the wonderful book Slaughterhouse 5. You guys literally do not even have to like try to sell this beautiful book to me because I'm buying this the day that it comes out I'm gonna be there. Wise and Nerve by Marissa Meyer. If you guys haven't heard of this book you seriously seriously need to look it up. It's going to be fantastic. <gasps> oh my god the actual book. It is Rose Blood by AJA Howard. I've only recently heard of this book and I'm so excited I have it now. I hadn't actually heard about it when I did my most anticipated reads of 2017. I literally heard about it only a few days. Oh my god, there's a signed book plate. Oh my god. Okay, I did not know what I was getting in this. This is amazing. So first of all, it's a hardcover. Absolutely stunning. And it's a book that I've been wanting. And it's got a signed book plate. And please don't tell me. Do not tell me. That is also a letter. This is a letter from the author. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Speechless. There's also one last little thing, and that says the Owl Crate Theatre on a button, which I shall proudly wear. So the book is obviously Roseblood by A.J. Howard. It is a modern day retelling of the Phantom of the Opera that will give you goosebumps as you turn each page. When 17-year-old Rune is sent to a French art school, rumoured to be the same opera house as the original Phantom once haunted, mysterious things have begun happening in her life. Plagued with musical afflictions, Rune befriends an elusive violinist named Thorn, while trying to keep at bay the creeping suspicion that someone is following her every move. Meanwhile, Thorn has dark secrets of his own and he'll have to choose where his loyalties lie. Will he cross his only father he's ever known in order to protect Rune? We fell in love with the gorgeous writing and detailed research that went into this brilliant new take on the classic tale. We also hope that you love the letter and signed book plate from A.G. Howard. And yeah, I love it. I love it all. This is my first ever Owl Crate box and I have been completely overwhelmed. I have no doubt in my mind why these guys are one of the best YA book subscription box in the entire world because it's fantastic. It is literally 
so amazing. I'm so happy with everything I've got and I'm going to cherish every single item and I cannot wait to start reading Roseblood. So that is January's box but the good thing about the way that book subscription boxes go is that there's always a box next month and for that we have a small little sneak peek to show you guys. So the theme of the February box is run away with the circus and as for the sneak peek the February box will include a delicious item from Frostbeard Studios. But for those of you who don't know what Frostbeard Studios is they do really amazing book related candles and you guys will totally enjoy that so definitely look at our crate I'll leave all the links below to all their online store and everything social media wise so you guys should check them out I encourage you to do that and definitely look into it because this is probably one of the best boxes I have ever received and I ain't no sellout so it's pretty strong coming from me to say that because it is my full-on honest opinion I'm very grateful that our sent me this and yeah it's all my own thoughts and my own excitement and as a disclaimer for that starting part no books were harmed or any items in this box during the beginning of this video I just thought it'd be a really really nice thing to show you guys how to correctly unbox an unboxing Thank you guys for watching, hope that you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully I shall see you guys again soon and until then I hope you guys have a lovely bookish day and let great things happen to you. But yes, don't play with fire at home, it is dangerous even though it is beautiful, it is very very dangerous. Get your parents permission or just be stupid like me and do it anyway inside of a house where smoke alarms are. Yeah, yeah.